WDAM Vice President and General Manager Jama Killingsworth with today's Consider This Commentary. It was my full intention today to stand here and talk to you about October being Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Breast cancer is a horrible disease that will affect one out of every eight women and kill more than 41,000 people this year alone. But instead, I'm standing here once again talking about horrific terroristic actions of a deranged madman who opened fire on Las Vegas concert goers, killing more than 50 and injuring hundreds of others. There are no words to comfort the victims and families and no magic sayings to expedite the healing of our once again wounded nation. Time after time, mass shooting after mass shooting, our response becomes typical. Some will point a finger at lax gun control laws and others will speak of the need for better mental health recognition and treatment in our country. But little will change other than our Facebook profile pictures that will now be filled with Pray for Las Vegas images. Sadly, however, there is little hope that our elected officials will have real debate on how to address the issue. Dealing with and finding solutions to our country's greatest problems have long ago taken a back seat to partisan politics. If a shooter gunning down a congressman at a softball field can't bring the two parties together to discuss solutions, then there's little chance what happened in Las Vegas will. And that's why this country will weep now, because we know that as we mourn for those lives lost in this week's shooting, we also know this isn't the last time we will be left shaking our heads and wondering when it will end. Consider this. Domestic terrorism is the greatest threat facing our country's safety. Not North Korea, not travelers from the eight banned countries, and not undocumented workers crossing our unsecured borders. This is one of many opinions. WDAM invites you to share your opinion at the Consider This section of WDAM.com or send your comments to the address on the screen.